pandas, and donkeys, and emus, oh my. A purchase band has gone to the animals in where else? Washington, D.C. We're weekend stars! <laughs> yeah! But why is this purchase band at the country's capital? For the red pandas, really? Um, it just so happens that we we're playing a show too, so that comes in handy. We're in DC to play a show in a, in a bar. My friend Mark asked us down. I came down like a month ago and played acoustic, and I made a huge impression. They were all like, man, we want you as your, as your band back. So we're back. DC's okay. Weekend Stars is about to rock it. Anyone in town is lucky. That's my side of the story. It's gonna be fun. I think the show's gonna be amazing. I think we're gonna rock everyone beyond what they can comprehend. And they did, but what's in it for them? You get to meet new people. I mean, purchase people are cool, but I really enjoy meeting new people, that, like strangers that actually enjoy what I, what I play. And as for their show, their drummer Paul summed it up. I feel pretty good about being here. I really wish we could uh, tour around the country every night. That'd be great. Because I'd love to see more than New York and DC. But what's next for Weekend Stars? What does the future hold for them? I hope we are a huge, famous band that everyone recognizes us and that everyone sings along to my songs. And just what kind of sound does the band bring from New York to DC? <laughs> Melodramatic pop songs, as MySpace describes it. Melodramatic pop songs with a dose of Purchase Weird. <laughs> The band is Beast. I'm Elise Michelanis for Panther Bites.